Hello, park friends and family. Uh, I hope that you are doing well. Uh, I just wanted to reach out to share some, some updates, things that are going on in Park Church right now. Uh, the first is, as, as many of you know, uh, we at Park are in the midst of a search process looking for a full-time family pastor. And, uh, and I'm excited to share that in, in the midst of this time of transition, uh, Rachel Hegner will be stepping into an interim role helping lead Park Kids until a hire is made. Uh, if, if you know Rachel Hegner, then you know that she, she loves Jesus and she loves kids and families. Uh, she's been serving as a grade level coordinator for some time now for Park Kids. And, and we're very excited to have her come and help us during this time as we continue to do whatever we can to, to help parents and families equip their kids to know, love, trust, and follow Jesus. Uh, the second thing I'd like to share uh, has to do with the question of when will Park Church be reopening for indoor worship. And, and as has been the case, we, we don't have a hard date yet uh, for when that'll happen. Very likely, uh, the next phase in our process of reopening will be once again coming together for outdoor worship gatherings once weather permits, which will likely be a month and a half, two months from now. Um, I, I know like many of you, I, I really miss seeing you and, and gathering together for worship and very much look forward to a time when we can do that once again safely. Uh, and so as a team, we here at Park Church, we're monitoring the situation and, and beginning to make plans for when that time comes. And, and the final announcement uh, really is more of a celebration. Uh, and, and it has to do with what's going on in our community groups right now. If, if you are involved or if you've heard any reports, you know that uh, we are taking time in all of our community groups to simply open the scriptures together and practice listening to the voice of God. And, and it's, it's amazing what I'm hearing from, from leaders and from other participants and other groups. I mean, even, even just myself, this last week, uh, the men in our community group got together and, and as we just listened together for God's voice in the scriptures, I, I walked away from that time with this clear sense of God inviting me to something very specific. Um, now, now it's up to me to actually listen and obey and do what he was inviting me to. Um, but it, it, it's powerful when we, when we actually take the time to slow down and to just listen, especially when we do that with one another. And so I'm, I'm encouraged uh, and, and I look forward to continuing to hear how God is speaking to us through his word together. Uh, thank you for taking time to listen. Um, grace and peace to all of you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ.